What's up, friends of the good mood? It's Manny, and welcome back to Demon Souls. Uh, right here, uh, let me just make a real quick sound check to make sure everything is fine. Yep, it is. So, today's plan is to kill uh, the boss here in the Boletarian Palace, uh, the second uh, boss, and to kill ourselves some dragons. And I think, in order to do this, the best way might actually be... Oh, oh, I forgot one thing. We need to... Hold on, hold on. Before we go on further, we have to go back. Uh, before we do this, I have to... Um, to get myself... Uh, to rid myself of unnecessary items. We carry so much stuff with us that we don't need. Uh, so let's, let's do this, okay? Um, let's go to Stockpile, oh, Thomas. Yeah. I'm keeping a close watch. Uh, and dispose of all the items that we do do not need. That includes all shards. That includes unnecessary weapon like a kill G, or even the Crescent Falcon. We don't we don't need this anymore. I think. Although right now I guess we could use it because we can't wield. The meat cleaver. So let's put the meat cleaver away for this time. Uh, the adjuctigator shield requires more stamina. It's not a very good shield. It's not really that good of a shield, I think. Um, the rest is all good. Yeah. So now we have a, a decent amount of rem uh, remaining item burden. Uh, let's go to the level and uh, shoot ourselves some dragons. All right. I wonder what will happen. What the heck? We only do 74 damage because... Um, uh, because that's only the amount of HP they have. So, if we could get this level to pure white tendency... That would be immensely good, because then I think this here would open. Only with pure white tendency that will happen. That means we we shall not die in this, in this level here, in human form. That would be very bad. There's a crystal lizard. And I don't know what else is here in this level. Um... Okay. I don't know how much damage we're actually gonna do. Oh, man. That's brutal. But you see the Uchi Katana is very heavy and it requires a lot of... Um, a lot of uh, stamina just to, to wield it. Thankfully, we did level up the stamina quite a bit, so we we don't have this much trouble with that. But we are very low on that. Firebomb. So, um, you remember this is where we killed the first boss. And if we move forward here, uh, then we uh, then we also encounter dragons, I think. But I want to I wanna get back to where we collected all the items from the dragons. Oh, hey. You there. Blobby blob. Um, I want to get to uh, to this position and kill the dragons with the bow, right there. Let's see if that works. Okay. <laughs> the first slash killed the blob and the first uh, the other guy behind it. Look how little damage they're doing to us. Oh, and I'm healing back the HP. Look, I healed back the HP already that they gave me. The damage. So here, somewhere up here should be the bridge. Yep, here's the bridge. Where the dragon came. If they hit me, they just don't they just don't do real damage to me. Uh, and I will just count counter generate the damage. I don't
don't even have to kill them because the dragon will do this for me, right? Or does the dragon not come when you've come from this direction? Oh, I forgot these guys. So awesome to just passively heal up health with a regenerator's ring. So here are the dragons, look. Okay, let's take a, a normal normal crescent moon grass because I want to be full. And then let's see how much damage we do against him. 18, that's not bad. Maybe if we get closer and hit the wing, maybe more. I guess at the wing you don't actually do damage. I'm not hitting him. 21. Alright, let's go for it. Look, it won't take a long time. We're actually dealing decent damage to him. And I think he can't hit me from here. If we were to use poison arrows, that would be also good, if we poisoned him. If we hit his head, we do more damage, but... Yeah, his head is pretty safe there. Wobbling around like crazy. Yeah, we already have him halfway down. I wonder how much souls he will give us if he gives us an item too. In Dark Souls, you get the Chris, uh, you get the Drake sword if you shoot the tail uh, of the dragon. Whoa! Hey, where are you going? What the heck, dude? Where are you going? He just flies away. Is he gonna come back? Okay, so this guy then? Am I not hitting him? Cannot damage their blue dragon. Maybe I have to hit his head. Yeah. I can't do any damage to him. Look. Huh. So now I could get the items easier because the dragon has gone. But this one is still here and I cannot deal any damage to him. Interesting. I didn't know that was a thing. All right, so let's go back um, and then continue on this level as I promised uh, because I get the feeling we haven't seen the last of the red dragon. Or the blue dragon? I don't know. Because there's something gonna happen that also happens in Dark Souls. Those who've seen or know Dark Souls may actually know what I'm talking about. When, when, when we are referring about uh, to a dragon, uh, then, yeah. Uh, okay, this is where I came from. Let's go all the way down here, preferably without falling like an idiot. <gasps> oh! 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 That was close, I almost did fall. I almost did fall like an idiot. Dude. <sighs> okay. I did it. The thing is, I cannot die here because I am in human form and I want this level to, um, to become pure white tendency so I can get into this first area. But if I was to die here now, 
But I think we're not gonna die. I think we have... Oh, what? Oh, my shield wasn't out. Can I break, break through their shield? What the heck? Are you telling me I just... Why can I do this? Normally, I shouldn't be able to do damage to them. Am I doing so much damage that I even go through their shields from the front? That's weird. Normally, you don't do damage to them, but I think I have never... You, yonder, over here. Hey. It's me, Ostrava. Oh, you again. Look at me. Again, fenced in by enemies. Could you assist me one last time? I hear the dragon. Clear out the soldiers blocking this passage, if it please you. The Lord's Path, just over there, is now a feeding ground for dragons. Have your wits about you. Yeah, I hear the dragon already. Okay, it's the same guy we've seen in the first level, too. Here. What's that blue thing? Oh, you could summon somebody here. Okay. Ow! Oh god, that scared the living crap out of me. I didn't see this guy in the distance there. Ow. They're really good at hitting you. Sharp stone shard. Yeah, we need a lot of those. Um, here's another item. Alright, so somehow I already hear the dragon normally. That is not the case, I think. What normally happens is... You go here. Yeah, he's already flying there. See that? Normally, he wouldn't be here. Normally, he wouldn't yet be here. It's the red dragon. It's the red dragon right here that we shot before. I wonder if he still has the damage taken that we gave him before. Let's test. Oh, wow, that was close. Let's see if we can kill him from here. And see if he has full HP again. Oh, I missed him. I, I have to first learn where to place the shot. Oh, I think they gave him full HP again. He's he's back at full health. Yep, they gave him full health back. Wow. That is unfair. But you know what? I think this time we can actually kill him. I I always hit him twice when he comes. I hit him once there and then I hit him once right over here. Because the thing is, he will he will follow us everywhere now. We we walk along the bridge and he will always come there and attack us when we are at the next part of the bridge. And I know from back in the days that you can kill him here. I didn't know that you cannot kill him at the other spot. I thought you should be able to kill him there. I told you we were gonna beat our kill ourselves a dragon here. My second shot missed. We have 140 arrows. That should be enough. Yep. 38 damage is what he takes every time he comes here. It will take us a few minutes, but... Um, and it might not be the most entertaining thing to watch, but... It's gonna be interesting to see how much souls we get from killing him. Maybe if we also get an item from doing so. And additionally, how the level will be without him. Right? That was 41 damage. Also, there are items on the bridge that we can then collect easily without worrying about fire on us. The second shot was a miss. Damn it. I've got to remember where to put that shot. Yeah, right there at this, at this tower right there. I have to aim it for the second one. Okay. And... Nice. Yeah, it won't it won't 
won't be long now before he goes down. Maybe five minutes and then we should be good. Oh, I missed. So I must shoot rather here. To the left of this spike tower. Like this. Nope, that was also a miss. Huh. Yeah, that was good. 40 damage. All right, now I know where to aim. So it should be easier and faster now. Fire. And fire. What? I still missed? Okay, it's a matter of when you fire, when you let go. That was a perfect headshot, the second one. I wish we could just shoot him down very quickly, but he always goes back. Yep. I think he's down to two-thirds of health. We have 116 arrows. I hope this is enough. We need to make sure to make every arrow count, right? We cannot miss too many arrows here because it would be a shame if after all this we don't get to actually kill him because we are running out of arrows. That would suck majorly. Uh, but I think that shouldn't be happening. We have enough. Yep, he's down to half life already. So you can you can scroll forward, guys. Don't worry. Uh, it's okay if you, if you skip forward. You don't have to stay here with me uh, and watch me do this all over the place. It, it will probably be like three or four minutes from now on, or five minutes. And then we're getting really close to killing him. Pretty sure you want to be there for the moment when we do get him killed. That was two times in a row I didn't hit. Two times in a row I missed a second. Now I got it, okay. I find it pretty lame that they regenerate his health. Uh, that they regenerate his health when he flies away in the first one. So you gotta kill him twice, basically. Or you just come here and make, make him come to this point first. But him regenerating health just because he flies over here, that is a bit lame. It just makes it so that we use way more arrows than than we needed to. But since the arrows don't really cost anything, like they're almost for free, so... Because I'm taking the ones that are very cheap. Two thirds of health. Uh, one third, sorry, one third. All right. It won't be long now. Oh, I got him. I thought I missed, but I got him. This time he won't fly away, I think. This time he will actually go, go down. One fourth of his health remaining. Yep. I think the last six or eight times I hit him with both arrows. That one didn't though. 484 arrows left, so we should be we should be in the green. This is I think the HP amount where last time he turned around and flew away. This time he won't. Yep. He would have flown away now if he did. But he comes back every time. I hear a crystal lizard, I think. I feel like I hear the twinkling of a crystal lizard. Yeah. Somewhere here must be a crystal lizard.
Dude, he's almost down now. He's almost dead. Oh, he is dead! Small scaled flame dragon soul. Small scaled flame dragon soul. Small scaled flame dragon soul. Let's see what we. Uh, uh, fl flame dragon or flame demon soul? What was it say? Uh, the small scale 10,000 souls. Yeah, you can't use this for any weapons, I think. Okay, I think uh, you could. Uh, you cannot use this soul uh, for upgrading weapons. Um, so you, you can actually just go ahead and consume it. This soul, here, this one, Crimson Red Dragon. Yeah, you can just consume this one. Gives 10,000 souls, nice. There was no reason not to use it here. Winged Spear, oh, okay. We're getting a, a, our first spear. Because a spear, for those who don't know, has one really good advantage. Let me show this to you guys. Here, you can attack while blocking, see that? <laughs> I'm holding up the shield and I'm attacking at the same time. This is something you can only do with a spear, I think. Nice. We got the dragon finally killed, so we don't have to worry about him destroying anything along the way anymore. Another winged spear? What? Okay, gotten all those. A wooden catalyst. Why am I getting so much stuff? Unknown hero's soul. I didn't even notice that we had killed the dragon. I thought he flew away one more time. But that's why we did so little damage. We did only 30 damage in the last round. That's why, because, because he didn't have more HP. Is this maybe where the crystal lizard is? I heard something twinkling. Left. Uh, yeah. Ow! Ow! Okay. Some dark corridor down here. And no twinkling, uh... No twinkling, um, thing here. Oh, gash-resistant ring. Against bleeding. Bleeding, I think, right? Uh, a legendary person awaits. Blue... Oh, blue-eye knight kuras. There's an armor that I don't know. And it looks amazing. It's, however, much worse than our armor is. But look how it... Oh my god, this looks so good. Look at the, the waist, like, the, the, the stuff that hangs down from it, too. Jesus, this looks so amazing, man. This armor is beautiful. Uh, But this one, it also looks very good. And it's better. This one here is simply better. Especially in terms of fire resistance. Uh, oh, but this one has much more durability. And it weighs less. Uh, but other than that, it's worse in every regard. But you know what? It's a game of looks too. And it looks so incredible good. I need to use this. It looks so good. I need to use this thing. And since it is, and since it weighs less than the others, I can actually equip helmet now, helmet and uh, and gloves. So I think overall we might come out with with more armor than before. Wow, this is cool. I like this. So hello, buddy. That's twice now. 
Yeah, we rescued you twice. Time to forge ahead. This is a token of my gratitude. Please accept it. What has he given me? Dark moon grass. Nice. Dark moon. So dark moon is more than full moon, or is it the same, or... I don't know. Cool. Dude, this armor looks amazing. Oh, I love the looks on this thing. Let's see what's here. Got him. Unknown hero soul, okay. Wow, I just killed four dogs in one slash with a katana. One slash, four dogs down. Present moon grass. I told you guys, this is the first level. It's much easier uh, for us now because we have already gained a lot of oh, a lot of power. We meet again. Fancy that. Hope you find something that suits you. He sell oh wait a minute he actually sells crescent moongrass also for less because remember the other people wanted 100 uh, 150 souls per per grass uh this guy only wants um 100 so let's get like 25 of that half moongrass is that also cheaper I'm not sure if he also sells... No, I think Half Moon Grass is the same price. So I'm not gonna buy that. Broadsword and Claymore. It's a two-handed sword, huh? And Broadsword would be a short one-handed sword. And he also says sells the long sword. I like swords. But we already have our katana. There's, there's not really a point in, in now leveling an, a level one short sword All again. Right. Let's talk to him, see what Brave he says. Knight or lowly fodder. The demons snatched their souls regardless of their station, plummeting them all into madness. And those who dare cling to their humanity were hunted down. It is the end of great Boletaria as we know it. But hell, at least the demons don't send us to our deaths in <gasps> uh oh, I just got invaded guys. I just got invaded Oh no We got invaded uh, And if I die then that is it with my uh, white tendency here in this level I'm scared. Now we could actually, you know what? We can summon a phantom now. I'm summoning a phantom because we are being invaded. So I can defend myself by summoning another player. I don't want to beat the boss with him, but I want to... Oh, that's that's this guy, okay. Aha! Gestures. <laughs> there, there she is, or he is. He or she. We have been invaded. I'm trying to... I would like to talk to her and tell her that we have been invaded. Uh, I'm not sure if she knows that already. Oh. Well. 
I'm not sure if she already knows that we have been invaded. And she probably doesn't know that the dragon is dead already. This is this is the co-op aspect of the game, by the way. Uh, this is the co-op aspect of this game. She's killing those things. Uh, I'll I'll pick up the soul soul here real quick. That I forgot. Present Moongrass, here we go. She's already fighting over there. Uh oh. Does she have the invader? Oh, she's already clearing everything here. Hold on. I've got to uh, collect the souls and things that are, that are here. <laughs> she's already running around killing all the uh, all the dudes. I just the thing is I don't want to die in human form now. This would suck so bad. Uh, because um, then 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 I wouldn't be able to. Oh, item capacity. Okay, so we have to equip the other ring. Item carry. Okay. Here, compound short bow again. I think we have the compound long bow, right? Yep. Whew, I don't know where the... Oh, there is the invader. There he is. I'm beating the hell out of him. She's healing, I'm healing. And... Come on. And backstab! Nice! He got her! Or he or she got him. She's running for her life. And that's it! Boom! Phantom destroyed. Nice. We do unwant her. Awesome. See, this is why I wanted to do uh, this this now uh, because I knew um, Otherwise we might although I think I could have probably beaten her in a one-on-one -on -one too because this this invader did not seem very, very powerful It didn't he didn't seem like a very powerful player. I think I could have one-on-one -on him successfully too in this case we will be um, I will send the phantom home because I want to do the boss himself um, how do I do a gesture? Um, waving. Gratitude. And then I send her home. Uh, send phantoms home. With thanks. She, she's saluting. She's saluting and I thanked her. That is awesome. It was like the guy understood or the guy or the girl understood that I'm trying to uh, beat the boss myself, but that I was that I needed his help against the enemy invader. It's like he knew. I thanked him and uh, now I sent him home. I could not have sent home the enemy phantom, right? That you cannot do. You cannot send send home uh, enemies. Um, but you can send home um, a friendly phantom and I did that now um, He helped me with the invader. That was good. That was the, um, the most important thing So and uh, oh, oh, oh the invader was probably very surprised that there was no dragon That there was no dragon that breathes fire because normally there is this dragon that breathes fire fire on the bridge And it didn't come this time because I already killed it All right, so we should be fast now because I want to get into the boss door without another invader coming in. 
And th this is this is good now. If we don't die at the boss, which I think I can beat him now. We are so powerful now, I think I won't die from him. And if that happens, maybe we get to pure white tendency. And with that, we should then be able to um, maybe get into this special area. The only reason I summoned the guy was because I didn't want to die in human form or in, in body form. Uh, and uh, I want to maintain my humanity and and get into a pure white world tendency so I can then get the um, get the good stuff here you could summon a lot of people here um, but I'm not wait open ah it's locked okay so ladies and gentlemen boss time okay I won't be regenerating health because unfortunately I have to wear the ring for the equipment load. But that's okay. Let's go for it. It's gonna be a big night. Boom! The Tower Knight! That's right, look at this guy! He's like 10 times as big as I am. In reality, there would be no chance for me to beat this thing. Oh wow, and archers everywhere, look. Archers left and right. Wow, that was more damage than I thought he was going to do to me. Uh, okay, let's get here in safety real quick and heal up. He's also shooting things, like he's sending some electricity. Look at this, with a mad spear. I, before I can beat him, I have to first kill the archers, obviously. With, with these archers, this fight becomes impossible. Three times press and moon grass. Once I've killed all the archers, then I can attempt to, be to, to beat the tower knight. But you've seen, he just hit me, hit me once and destroyed half my HP. If you were trying to beat this guy with all those archers still in place, uh, I don't think that's possible, or at least it's very difficult. Okay, so now, now we can attempt to beat the guy. And the way this works is you have to get behind him and hit his ankles. Oh, he steps on my, on, on my head. Like this, and then you have to hit the ankles. Uh-oh, you got me with that. And then he falls, like this. And when he does, then you can hit his head. Wow, and then you can kill him in three slashes. Super easy. Okay, you shall obtain the demon soul. I love this armor. Iron iron demon soul. Now, do we get to pure white will tendency now? I don't know. We can only know if we go into the nexus and then have a look at how the, how the world tendency has changed. Maybe we do actually get into pure white. That would be very awesome. Yeah, I think it's pure white now. Amazing, man. So, for the first time, I think also, I'll be able to uh, check out the uh, the secret area here in uh, in this uh, in this level. The thing is, though, if I fail and if I die, let's just check. I think that this door is now open. Is it? Yes, it's open now. But the thing is, there's gonna be some enemies who technically could beat me. But you know what? Let's do it. 
Oh no, you know what? That would be a bad idea. Because if I die in there with all those souls that I have right now, then I can't get back in to get my souls. I misclicked. We have to, we should probably get a different level, a, a, a die. We should probably play a different level soon, die somewhere else. And, uh, or I just use the souls. I'm just gonna use the souls and then we're gonna risk, risk the fight in there. Right, let's see. You can't get in there without being, uh, without being as strong as we are now, I think. So the enemies will be difficult. Okay, so let's get to faith, right? 16 faith. And then we need to get stamina up, uh, uh, strength up to 26. Let's repair all our weapons. Uh, and then using a hero soul and maybe another one too because we need some souls to level up one more time I don't have enough I need 500 more okay Okay, now. Good. Now we have, we only need one more level up and then we can use the meat cleaver. We can already use it, but it's, it's going to be two handed. Let's check it out. Oh, I don't have it here. That's right. Uh, and I need to empty my weapons again. Jesus Christ, am I having so much stuff with me? Unreal. Let's uh, let's remove some of those too. We don't need to use that uh, to have that many. I never use that. Let's just remove a, a, a lot of it right here. Not all of it, but a lot of it. Because it all has some weight and I don't need that. Okay. Now we don't need the Crescent Falcon anymore. But we want the Meat Cleaver. Uh, where is it? There. Nice. Oh, and we got a new shield. Spiked shield. I just realized. We should check out how this, how this thing is. Okay, our armor. Put it away. You have a heart of gold. So we are down to very low thing. We can now go and heal. Use the healing ring. The regenerator's ring. There. And we can use the meat cleaver. Oh, let's check out this shield. Oh, it has very little guard break, but yeah, I don't know. Not, not really an interesting shield for me. Meat cleaver. We can use it two-handed. Wow. What's the heavy attack gonna be? And what's the damage gonna be? We- Wow, we get- We get a scaling of 90 base damage plus 160 damage uh, from our attribute scaling and then 90 plus 30 on magical. Wow. Cool, that's a powerful weapon. But it's gonna be- I, I'm gonna stick with the Uchi Katana just for the- for this area that we're going to do now. Uh, because I know- I wanna use a weapon that I know, that I'm very familiar with. Chances are there's something strong coming for us and I- I wanna play as good as I can. Gates of Boletaria. This guy up there is coming. All right, so for the first time, let's go and check out this area here. Wow. That's a cool place. There's also a crystal lizard.
Uh oh, three phantoms, three red phantoms at the same time, man. Oh wait, those are not powerful. Those are not very powerful phantoms. They are more powerful than the usual enemies, but they are not super powerful. Crescent Moongrass, Unknown Warrior Soul, Unknown Warrior Soul, Unknown Warrior Soul, another one, and another one. Nice. Okay, cool. This is a very, very hard to get, very secretive area, because you can only get in here when you have the uh, will tendency on pure white. Okay, more red phantoms. Okay. Ow. What the heck? I didn't get him? Okay, now I did. How many more are spawning here? There's more and more of these guys spawning in. Is there gonna be one stronger enemy too? Renowned warrior soul. Wow, it goes in here. I had no idea this exists. <laughs> uh oh. You traitors to the king. I know. Who is she? I shall show you no mercy. <laughs> She's laughing as I'm whooping at her. <laughs> Is she dead? Foolish traitor to the king. Wow. <laughs> Four thousand four hundred fifty souls. <laughs> and master's ring, binded boots, binded gloves, and so on. Holy smokes, that was cool. I wonder what else there is. An item? Oh, you could, you could walk off the edge here and die. You could walk off the edge, fall and die. This is the first time I'm seeing this. Poison resistant ring. Oh, jeez. Slime bladder. There's an item here that you can only get if you jump down here. But let me first see what the rest of the area holds before I risk something that dangerous. And you see a lot of people do die here. Are you kidding me already again? Um, Herculean strength. Wow! Another full armor set. Do you hear that? Is there some some monster or something? Is this maybe a boss? I don't know. The thing is, if I die now in human form, then that is going to be it. There's gonna that's gonna be it for. We're figuring out what's going to happen here, but you know what? Let's do it. What? You die there. 
You just you just go there and you die. You 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 die when you touch the la the, the ground down there. But it's wait, it's still open. Get out of my face here, man. It's still open. It's not closed. Because the game still says it's it's bright tendency. I think the tendency will only reset if we go back to the nexus. So as long as we don't do that, we should be able to um playing ring. Uh, as long as we don't go to the Nexus, we should be able to uh, explore this area, I hope. I didn't know you would f you would instantly die just because... Oh, the Crystal Lizard. Uh, because you touched the ground. Ah, hey! Also, I didn't know... That, um... That these these red phantoms can spawn when you are not human. How long is the video going? Uh, 51 minutes already. Okay, but let's clear this area first before we move on. Okay. We should also try that meat cleaver. Let's try this thing against the uh, the lady. The lady around the corner. Oh, fat roll. This weighs less and this weighs less. Whoa. The Binded Cross is actually really good for how little it weighs. It is very good for how little weight it has. And it lo looks pretty good too. Wow, okay. Is the... No, she's not here anymore. I'm going down here again because there's still this item and my souls on the bottom, right? I want to get those souls back. I didn't know you would die just from jumping down into the water. Because there was this, this sound effect of, of a boss uh, or, or something growling, some monster. I, f I gotta say I find it a little bit lame. That they kill you just because you you touch this 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 thing down there. I thought I thought that was gonna be a boss fight now because I've never been in this area before. And yeah, so let's see if we can get this item down there somehow. Well, it's gonna be difficult to to make this jump. Yeah, you have to walk over this beam here. And death. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, what I'm gonna do, uh, I, I don't want, I don't make you guys rewatch this part ten times. What I'll do, I'll try it as often as I need. Let's try how much damage the sword. Oh no, we can't see how much damage the sword does because they don't have enough HP. Um. But I, I will skip to the point where I am on the on the item, okay? So see you guys then in the next episode. This is how we start. And then afterwards, we're going to do, um, I think, the storm level. Or I don't know what level we're actually going to do. All right. So uh, see you guys then. Manny signing off. Bye-bye.